Hello viewers, welcome to our video Talking to the Moon. Uh, today is 20 February 2023 and uh, at this day we are entering the new moon in Pisces. Okay, so we are beginning a new cycle of the moon and when you are beginning a new cycle of the moon what we see is only a sliver of the light of the moon only the sides of the moon and the rest are still shadow so when you look at this one uh, many of the things that are going to unfold in this cycle are still a mystery and uh, the advice of the monology manifestation card is attune to the divine so listen to the spirit as you begin this new chapter because everything is still a mystery the advice of the monology manifestation card is listen to the divine we'll try to read from the handbook that accompanies this card and maybe we can gain more insight about attuning to the divine you have the opportunity to slip into the flow of life now when that happens you want what is happening and what is happening is what you want okay so it's good okay at the beginning you want what is happening right now and what you want is manifesting itself that's nice your manifesting is working perfectly so everything is doing going well just make sure that you stay attuned to your higher self and you will be well on your way to feeling blissfully happy and in tune with your dreams meditation is the best way to connect with your higher self so practice it if you know how or try learning from an outline an online instructional video above all else be kind to yourself and to others okay so nurture yourself spend more time in prayer and solitude so that you will be able to receive the messages that you need as you begin this new chapter now because it is also the new moon we will try to see what is the insight from the moon magic cards uh, here with regards to new moon so it's a beginning again you see here everything uh, everything is still a mystery there is a cloud surrounding the moon and the other parts of the moon is still dark so in a certain sense yeah it's a quite it, the, it, the, the new stage the new cycle is uh, pregnant with surprises okay let's try to read from the uh, moon magic handbook that accompanies this card it says here the new moon is a lovely card and represents fresh starts innovative ideas and new beginnings okay so new beginnings you might have good fresh starts and uh, new starts and uh, innovative ideas okay it means that something new is on the way to you this could be a new job so if right now you're beginning a new job a love interest or a special event okay but something new is coming into your life to brighten things up a bit this is a card of optimism and positivity and suggests the answer to your question is yes when the new moon shows up in a spread it indicates that now is the time for goal setting for having faith that your dreams will come true Use the energy surrounding you at this time to decide what you would like to achieve in the new few months, in the next few months. Be open-minded about any invitation or opportunities that are extended to you at this time. Remember, the success in any field is a collaboration between you and the universal energies of attraction. So it's between you and the spirit world between you and the spirit focus on what you want not on what you don't this card is a gentle reminder to keep your thoughts positive and to believe in your own magic so be careful on what you manifest because if you think of them they will come true okay it suggests that a blessing is indeed on the way but that you must play your part by being open to receive it so be positive uh, don't put any obstacles to your dreams at this time. Ask the divine with faith as you begin a new 
chapter. Now we will try to end this uh, this uh, talking to the moon with one uh, tarot card that would somehow give us uh, sort of a an idea or a message regarding these next two weeks. So we'll try to see what will be the main energy for the next two weeks. So we are going to this is the practical tarot. We're going to get one card randomly. Okay, the card that we took right now is we have here the three of swords. Okay, so there might be a certain challenge that you're going to face. No, uh, a certain issue in your life that you might face right now. But uh, let's try to see what is the message from this one. I'll try to read it from here. It says here. Um, heartbreak is hard enough enough holding on to those emotions makes it worse let this card remind you to write out your feelings then let them go with love you are in charge of your own happiness no time like now to clear your heart of unwanted visitors okay so now that you begin this new moon cycle if there is something that is causing you pain right now, this is the time for you to let it go. According to the card, the best thing to do is to write down. So my advice to you today, if you have your free time, or maybe right now after watching this video, get a piece of paper, write down what is causing you heartache right now, or uh, something that... Uh, that is really causing you difficulty and anxiety that makes it rain in your parade okay you write them down you write them down these things and then you tell yourself it's time for me to set you free now you can do it in a symbolic way you can burn that paper as a symbolic way of letting that thing go or if you are a little bit more creative, you can create a small paper boat, put it in a stream and let it go. Okay, uh, so you, you can make a small paper boat or you can just burn it and tell yourself, let it go. And then say a little prayer. I entrust to you, Lord, this thing that causes me pain right now, I am letting it go. So... Uh, as you start this new chapter, you start a new page. You turn the page, leave behind this painful situation. I know it's going to be a long process to overcome this, but a journey of a thousand miles begins with one step. So take that one step today and address this one so that you can begin this new cycle of the moon in a positive note. You entrust, if it, need, if it requires healing, then you entrust it to the divine. If it is a relationship, maybe it's time for you. If it's causing you pain and somehow the person also wants to be free, then maybe it is time for you to let it go. So it's time for you to let go of whatever things brings that brings you anxiety or pain at this time of your life so this is what we have right now for uh, the new moon in Pisces I hope that it has been beneficial for you right now uh, this will be uh, somehow your your message and your advice for the next two weeks as we wait for the next part of the cycle which is the first quarter moon more or less about two weeks from now so Thank you for the likes and comments you've given to the channel. Thank you for subscribing. I hope to see you again in the next part of this, of this cycle of the moon, the quarter moon. Uh, I think that will be on, let us see. So right now is February 20. On the 27th of February, we will be entering the first quarter moon in Gemini. So for the next few days until the 27th of uh, February, so that is seven days from now, try to work on this one, letting go of things that no longer bring you joy, 
the things that no longer help you in your journey. Well, thank you. I hope to see you again soon. Until that time, may God continue to bless your ways.